Good afternoon, YouTube. This is Sinclair, bringing you another tutorial on, you guessed it, Kick. There's a few things I wanted to clear up with Livebot, as well as how to ban, how to mod on Kick. I searched and I searched and I searched, and guess what? There was no videos. So, what are we doing today? Making a tutorial. Let's get into it. All right, so the most important thing is what you see above the screen right there. When you hover over their name, it's showing you the options for report, reply, ban, or delete their message, like to mute them. Wow. This is super important when it comes to your stream to make sure that you leave a browser open so that you can go back and ban people if you need. I can't stress enough. Maybe have like a phone or a laptop that has your chat open, but make sure that you leave one open because once the message is gone, it's gone. It does not store it like Twitch does or other platforms. Those messages disappear once the browser has been cleared. So keep that in mind. Now, as far as adding moderators go, it's very simple. You go into the community tab from the creator dashboard, click add moderator, and it's as simple as that. Once they have got the moderator badge, it's gonna show just like it shows up here with a little symbol of the crown and then you know you've modded the channel now let's clear up some things on chatbot i'm gonna go ahead and get that ready okay we're back here to livebot so there's been a couple of confusions on how to get your channel connected i wanted to clear that up real quick this is the part that people keep getting confused about about the code all you have to do is put the name of your channel twice and then click add this channel. It'll then give you a command to add that you put into your chat. And then that allows it to connect. And then when you go to set up the alerts underneath overlay, your follower alerts, your sub alerts, if you have subs, all of that is gonna be already right here. You just literally copy the URL and paste it in as a browser source. And then it's literally that simple and then once someone follows, it literally triggers it. But that's the most important thing, is to follow the steps right here, exactly to a T. Quick side note, make sure you add Livebot as a moderator. That's the most important step. Most people kind of forget about that this is a chatbot. Go ahead and go ahead and add in your socials. Go ahead and add in like a rules command. Use the chatbot part of it as well. It's not just for alerts. It has other features in it. Not, a not just that, there's also chat filters that you can add to ban certain words so that you don't have that pop up in your stream. And if, if they use certain words, it can literally automatically ban them. So that is what I wanted to clear up. Remember, when you go to add a channel, add in the name of your channel twice, and then it will ask you if it doesn't verify to type in a command into your actual chat. And then once you've done that, it's done. And it's that simple. I hope this has cleared up some issues that you guys have been having. If you have more questions, feel free to comment below. But remember, you can ban them, but save your chat and make sure it is open. If you guys haven't already subscribed to the channel, please make sure you do so so you can stay up to date on kick tutorials and anything streaming. Have a wonderful, blessed evening.